A new deal between the NFL and a group of players could mean an end to protest during the national anthem. KPIX 5's Katie Nielsen is at Levi Stadium in Santa Clara to explain how. A deal was finalized late last night where NFL team owners would donate almost $100 million over the next seven years to various social causes supported by the Players Coalition. But there's no guarantee the protests will end. The anthem played on Sunday before the 49ers took on the Seahawks and at the same time, some 49ers players, including safety Eric Reed, took a knee. It's not a new site at Levi Stadium where former quarterback Colin Kaepernick first started the protest last season. And then President Trump weighed in. Wouldn't you love to see one of these NFL owners when somebody disrespects our flag to say, get that son of a off the field right now, out, he's fired. But instead, late last night, the NFL and team owners tentatively agreed to put up $89 million over the next seven years for the Players Coalition to support social justice projects and African-American community organizations. I think it's a step in the right direction. In, in my house, $100 million is a, is a lot of money. Team owners hope the donation show they're serious about players' concerns and also hope it leads to fewer players protesting the anthem. There's no language in the agreement that says players must stand for the anthem, but some owners say if the protests continue after the donation, they'll start playing the national anthem first, then bring the players out onto the field. In Santa Clara, Katie Nielsen, KPIX 5. And team owners could vote to finalize the deal with the Players Coalition at an upcoming meeting next month.